Let's extrude the splines that will aid us in creating the details of the blower. With that, we need to turn on the visibility of our sketch too. Selecting this eyeball. Shortcut key for extrude is Shift E. And let's change the mode to surface. Let's now select this splines. I will not select this arc for now because it intersects or touches this spline. If I select this, it will turn these two entities into one surface. So let's create a separate extrusion for this arc. Selecting the green check mark, but first let's head over to top view, making sure that we are going way past the outline of our blower. In addition, let's change the direction to symmetric. Grabbing this arrow. I'm okay with this depth. Right clicking and selecting confirm extrude one. Let's repeat extrude hitting shift E. Activating surface and uh, selecting this arc. Heading over to top view, changing the direction to symmetric, and pulling this arrow down. Inspecting, right clicking, and selecting confirm extrude 2. With all the surfaces in place, let's focus first on our two primary surfaces i'm going to select this surface which is surface one and surface two with both of them selected i'm going to right click and select hide other surfaces in addition turning off the visibility of sketch two 